Gonna get a lot of dough. Anything is possible. Turn me up in the headphone. Yeah. Trying to get a lot of dough and dirt through all the obstacles, cause anything is possible. Yeah. Oh man, I got a lot of gold. Stack that bread and buy my nose. Anything is possible. Yeah. yeah. Trying to get a lot of dough. Welcome back to Kicks for the Low by yours truly, Richie B. Today, we have a detailed in hand review of the Nike collaboration with Space Jam New Legacy. This is the LeBron 18 Low Wally Coyote versus Roadrunner colorway. So let's get into it. Originally released. July 16, 2021, for that retail price of 160 bucks. Right out of the broken box, my thoughts were, hmm, interesting. My size is 11 and a half, and in LeBron 18 low, they fit me just perfect, true to size. My first reaction was total confusion. These Mitch match, mismatch, colorways, they're not really for me, to be honest. This shoe is very detailed, so let's just go over it. The upper of this shoe has like some kind of, it feels like a suede, okay? This is a plastic piece, it feels plastic. Right here, it's metallic, shiny portion. It feels like a patent leather. This right here is like ripstop, ripstop fabric. I like the swoosh, the swoosh. Looks like a cloud of smoke. If you know anything about the cartoon. Same thing on the toe, rip stop. This is like a, seems like a plastic overlay. This right here feels like a piece of suede, the red portions. And the tongue is made of that rip stop material. Laces on this shoe, they look like ropes. Look, they look like these are rope style laces. If you look at the pattern on the rope, uh, on the laces, it looks like a rope. You got Acme um, logo tune squad on the tongue. The inside, as you can see, the details here, the clouds, or they could be um, some type of abstract birds. It's a real, really detailed, and obviously, you see at the bottom right here, the shoe has Nike React, the air bubble. This is a plastic portion right here. It's a very, very detailed shoe. Very nice. Like right here where they put beep beep. Right here you got some kind of logo. That's the LeBron logo. Inside, I like this a lot. The inside has the roll runner's face because this is his shoe. The bottom. Okay, on the left shoe, same material. I like what they did with the swoosh right here. Has Acme Company right behind this rope feature on that red swoosh. Looks uh, looks like some type of looks like they tried to do some kind of wood aesthetic. Same thing, plastic up here. No, this is suede. This is no no patent leather up here. Same thing on the tongue, rip stop, suede, tune squat. <laughs> Look at that. And the inside on the tongue, it says help. Has a hand there. It got real creative on this shoe. LeBron's logo on the tongue, different color. <laughs> Look at that. Nice. Bottom of the shoe. My overall thoughts were that they were very creative designing this shoe and incorporating the movie. This is not for everyone, but I'm bringing this to you guys just so that everyone can get an idea of some kicks that's for the low. As you can see on the inside of the shoe, we have extra added comfort. Comfort, it seems like some type of foam. They even have the inside of the shoe. The 
inside of the shoe has roll runner on this one on the right shoe on the left shoe you have the coyote let me know your thoughts down in the comments now is this a let's get it or a no go come on and hang out for a while while i roll some close-ups Get a lot of dough, anything is possible Turn me up in the headphone Yeah Grind it, get a lot of dough And dirt the water obstacles Cause anything is possible Yeah Oh man, I got a lot of gold Stack that bread and vomit nose Anything is possible Yeah, yeah. 